This is gonna be a really brief video on a 10 round group with this 6.5 Creedmoor rifle. Now, a lot of you guys always want me to do um, like a revisit on loads that we've shot in the past that shot really good. In the last video that we shot specifically with this gun, we shot a load with the 140 grain arrow match bullets with Vitivori N560 that looked really promising. If I can remember, I'll try to put up a little clip of that right now. And normally I don't go super in depth onto all the details on this stuff. I will say that um, the details on the rifle will be in the description, but I am gonna go over the load data as well on camera. So the load that we're using right now is gonna be Alpha Large Rifle Primer Brass. Brand new brass, I did not run it through a full length sizer. Normally I would recommend doing that, but I just chamfered the case mouth primer powder bullet and then we're off to the races. So we're just gonna retest it on paper. And if it goes as well as I think it will, we'll probably just run with this load as a cheap match load, so to speak. But I say cheap, you could go cheaper, obviously, but like as far as the bullets being a little more inexpensive than burger, um, I, I do like burger bullets, but they, they are kind of pricey. So that being said, this is literally just 45 grains of Vitivori N560 with Alpha Large Rifle Primer Brass. We're using Federal Large Rifle Gold Metal Match Primers and, um, the 140 Hornady arrow match bullets. I've got 10 rounds loaded. The first one I think had a different seating depth, so there might be something wonky with it. I can't remember exactly what it was, but I know there was something different. Um, so the first one might be a little weird, but the rest of them I'm hoping will be pretty darn consistent. Now, again, we're shooting one group, that's it. I, I got 10 rounds loaded. First one might be a little weird, but we're just gonna aim for the dead center of the target. We're gonna see how these do. We're gonna measure the velocity like usual. And ideally we get a really good group, but like I said, you guys just always ask me to revisit good loads. And typically I just don't show them on camera because when I get what I want, then at that point it's, you're not really learning anything. It's just, it shoots, right? So hopefully they'll sh shoot really good and I won't look like an idiot, but um, they might shoot super poorly. And then all of a sudden, uh, you know, I just look stupid. So we're gonna go ahead and send 10 rounds on paper here. Again, 45 grains of Vitivori N560 with that 140 arrow match bullet. I'm gonna go for the dead center middle of the target here. And I'm going to go through these relatively quick, but I will read off the velocities. 2775. 27.59. 27.60. 2750 2750-2749-2770 2755 2760 and 2771 so obviously things could have been better that wasn't like the perfect load so to speak i will say um it has gotten super windy since I started shooting this morning. I, when I first got out here, it was very calm and it is no longer very calm. So that might not be helping our case any, but I do think that the velocities could have been a little bit tighter too, honestly, but we got the SD under 10, which is usually what we go for. So I'm happy with it, but we're looking at an average muzzle velocity of 2760, extreme spread of 26 and a standard deviation of 8.9. So again, um, as long as that standard deviation is under 10, then I'm happy in the group. It's not the best group I've ever seen, but it ain't bad. And for 10 shots um, with this gun, I'll take it. It's good enough. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I know this was kind of simple, nothing too crazy, but um, if you like the idea behind doing just the revisit video with one load, then by all means, please let me know because it does help me decide how to format these videos going forward. But you guys remember to glorify God, stay risen, take care, y'all be safe, and we will see you in the next one.